What's going on everyone? It's Evan and Megan again and today we are going to Mexico. Finally! Finally. We are in Cotulla today. Cotulla? I don't know. It's a weird word. We're gonna have to be used to this because we're gonna be saying a lot of weird words from here on out. Yeah. And going to Monterey. Mm -hmm. Hopefully we got up early enough and we can hit the border before it gets too busy. We're gonna take you along for the ride. All right, let's go. In case you're wondering, yes, I do still have to tuck my ears in to my helmet. <laughs> That's okay. So I'm guessing this is right. What is AVI? I don't know. Uh, Shit, I might have messed up. Hey, brother. I'm not sure what an AVI vehicle is. I might have gone on the wrong way. <laughs> yep. Okay, sorry okay. about that, man. Thank, Thank you. you. I need to be over there. They said I could probably just go through the cone. Go around it? Okay. Thank you. I can move the cone. I can weave. Have your tool ready. Tool 350. Hi. Cash only? Yes. Okay. I don't have a 50, is it? You don't have any smaller bills? Yeah, we had to use all of our smaller bills earlier today. Okay, you'll have Mexican money? No, we were kind of confused. We okay, thought. I'm sorry, we don't take 50 and 100 bills. Okay, um, what would you like to make a return? Do you want to open the door over there with the red phone? Okay. Okay, we can do that. Thank you. Now we know. All right, well. Okay, over to him. Over to him. I have quarters in the bag. You have 350 and quarters? I'm sure I do, but it's packed in the duffel. Oh, geez. Thank you. All right, well. So there's, it says, let's see, you cannot turn there. So, it's a St. Ursula. Um, there were some places we could do like exchanges or if you want to open up the bag, I can grab the no, quarter. No, 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 no. We don't have to open up the bag. That's too much work. I already know the title for this video. This is how you don't cross the border into Mexico. Yeah. So it looks like this is a drive through right here, too. So you can just go up to the window. Yep. Boink. Uh, is it around the corner here? Well, that arrow says that way. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, look at that. Oh, I was parked right here. Cool. Curious. Nope. Is there a button I push? Please. 
I don't feel like anyone's here. It says open. Oh, I know it says open, but there's nobody inside. <laughs> there's no one? Nope. Okay. Well, there was another one. There's another one right over there. Try that. Cool. You were very kind. Yes. Okay. Okay, this is just gonna take you back on the... I know. No. Uh, Casas no, de Cambio. Oh. Yeah, with that white truck in front of it. I'm looking at the one over there. That's when we were just at. What the? And there's a truck right there too. Green. I'll go straight. Why don't you try this one? Oh. we were just on right here. Motherfucker. Oh, so it was just in the alley of that other place we were at. Okay. Well, big loop. Okay, well, also there was another one dead ahead, so if you want to get in the far lane, then we can hit that one. Do you see? Straight ahead there's another one, but you need to be in this lane. Are you talking about the one that says Casa de Cambio Insurance to Mexico? Yeah. We just passed that one. There's nobody in there. It's closed. That's the one because we had to take a left, and you were like, it's going to take us right back to the north. And I was like, oh, there's one right there, but it's closed. So we had to do a oh. loop around. Ah, uh, yes. And this so, is the one we were just at. And, and there's someone at the drive thru who just left, too. Yeah, there must be no one in there. What do you see? Ah, okay. Can you stick your left arm out? back, baby. Now there's someone there. There wasn't really? someone there a moment ago. She was hiding. Okay, you want to jump off? We're not even in Mexico yet. <laughs> I know. Okay, yeah, see. My level of Spanish right now is just nodding and saying see. Yes. <laughs> okay, gracias. Gracias, buen día. Buenos días. Did you get small enough, Bill? <laughs> You went pesos, USD receipt. Eh, whatever. Did you get small enough bills? Uh, let me see. It's three dollars. Three US dollars. Twenty, forty, sixty. I got a two hundred. There's 200. a fifty. So it's yeah. three US dollars, which is like sixty pesos. Maybe she can like change the two hundred out for fifties or something, just to be safe. What's fifty? Fifty. Okay, so this is like one dollar, six. No, 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 I mean like in Spanish. Uh, cinquenta. 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 Uh, pregunta, um, uh, uh, puedo tengo, uh, uh, cinquentas? Is it? Oh, yeah, gracias. <laughs> Numbers are not my strong suit. Good thing you're here, Megan. No, yeah. Ah, oh. excellent. Gracias. Okay, adios. Cool. Oh, 
Okie doke. Now, I'm gonna stuff this in my pocket. <laughs> Let's try it again. You're back. No, I'm definitely not that guy. <laughs> no, that was my evil twin. That he was my it. stupid evil twin. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling ready. Honestly, I wanted to go in this one again so we could see our lady friend. <laughs> yeah. She's like, we got it this we time. We can do it. Aw. She's over there at two now. No, lady, I did it. Can you let the lady at two know that I did it? <laughs> Hello. There you go. 22 pesos. Yep. We got a little screwed on our exchange rate. Always. It's fine. It happens. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Have you. a good day. Thank you. God. We did it! We got through the U.S. border part. <laughs> we were made fun of twice. It took us forever to find money. Then now. Now we still have to go through the Mexican border. <laughs> Gosh, remember when we crisscrossed the Canadian border like six times like wizards? I got it done in my sleep. Like wizards. <laughs> yeah, we were like wizards. Okay, Mexico. Auto buses. Self-declaration, not a... Nothing to declare. Nope. Advance. Thank you. I didn't smile. So far, it looks like uh, the head nod in Mexico is accepted. So nice. it's, good. it's good news. Good. This might be it up here. Yeah. Thinking so. Temporal day vehicle is. OK. <sighs> We made it. Yeah, we did. Well, I'm not gonna bring a camera inside. No. No. We'll be back. All right, y'all, uh, well, that was interesting. It was chaotic. But, but we figured it out. <laughs> really quickly, because I'm gonna leave in the description below um, what it is you need if you're gonna come and do this, as well as like a quick guide. Yep. Because everything I read online was like partially true, and it might have just been like the guy we were working with, but long story short, the immigration form that we prepaid for online, we printed out that piece of paper, yeah. and when we went up to get it stamped, he said that we needed a receipt from when we got it, and I didn't have mine, because I didn't know, it didn't say it anywhere didn't that say you needed it. It didn't say anywhere online that you needed it, and even on the website where we filled out the forms, there was no way to go back and like look at your receipt. Seat, even though we got confirmation emails and we got the forms, yeah. which is proof of payment in itself. So you can't get the form without payment. So so Megan had hers. She screenshotted it because she thought ahead. I didn't have mine. So after digging around and realizing there was no way to go back and get the receipt, I had to repurchase a f immigration form for today just to get the confirmation receipt. And then I used that for the one that I already had because it takes a couple days to get it anyway. And then you need copies upon copies of everything. And you can pay for them here. It's just kind of expensive. So yeah. our recommendation, make multiple copies of things, bring some Ooh. pesos. Yeah, we'll leave a description down there. Yeah, we'll cause... have a whole guide, but uh, we have been in there for over an hour. Yeah, everyone was friendly enough, though. Friendly, but we just kept going back and forth and back and forth, and we looked like those stupid Americans who didn't know what they were doing because, well, that's what we were, so. Oh, well, what are you going to do? Now we know, and we are going to head south. I still don't know if we've crossed the border yet. I think we're in Mexico. I don't know. No, I mean, everything I think we're in seems pretty seems Mexican pretty right Mexico -y. now. Over there, you can see not Mexico. And then over here, you can see Mexico. Yeah. But hey, welcome to Mexico. Oh. oh let's try it again. Good enough. All these people are like gringos, man. <laughs> they get one immigration form and they're freaking out.
This is our first time attempting to get gas in Mexico. Now, if it was anything like trying to get into Mexico, it should prove to be quite entertaining. And wildly confusing for such a simple task. For us. We're going to make it wildly confusing for them. Hola. Oh, I see. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's good. Efectivo cash. Oh, cash? Yeah, cash. Puro, puro efectivo, nada de tarjeta. Oh, no, no. No uh, tarjeta. Solo, 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 solo pesos? Solo pesos. Oh, okay, solo pesos. <laughs> Excelente, no problema. Okay. I think he wants you to fill it up first. Yeah, okay. Okay, so, uh, fill? Full. Full? Yeah. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice full? Full, hierro, hasta arriba. Arriba? Hierro, hierro. Hierro, hierro. Okay, hierro, okay. <laughs> Excellent. Cool. Well, that wasn't too bad. That was easier than expected. <laughs> wow, it's like I have been in Mexico a while. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't go that far, Rady. No, I would not either. Let's see what this is. Might just be a checkpoint. I'll follow this car. Yep. officially made it to our Airbnb for the next couple days. And as you can see behind us, there's some more of those mountains. So 
pretty. Yeah, this is a very, very pretty spot. So we're excited to be here, wind down. We promptly found a 7-Eleven and bought some beer <laughs> and an avocado. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it was a fun day. Yeah, it was a fun day. Uh, definitely like just tired now that we're calming down. So mm -hmm. fun, a little bit stressful but not as stressful as I thought it would be. Yeah, learned some lessons, almost accidentally came into Mexico illegally, which was <laughs> wild. Uh, all you have to do is pay the toll and then you just drive across. And if you don't stop to get your like immigration form stamps and everything, you can just accidentally drive into Mexico. Although if somebody ever asked for them and didn't have them, I'm sure they'd figure it out, but. And you'd be screwed. Yeah, all in all, a good day. <laughs> we learned a lot, a lot to, uh, I don't know, it's kind of funny, yeah. but eh, that's what comes with these uh, experiences, right? When you put yourself in these weird situations. Every day will be a learning opportunity. That's right. Well, if you like this video, please like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you have gone through the border down to Mexico and had a similar experience or some sort of different experience you think we or somebody else should know about, throw it down in the comments. That'd be super cool. Let us know. Yeah. Let's, let's educate everyone so they're not as big of fools as we were. Hopefully not. <laughs> Although I have a feeling that's going to happen some more. Yeah. All right. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. Can't wait to see you next time. Much love. Bye. Peace.